Hey, it's your TC Josie. In this video, I'll be reviewing how I set up my filters, labels, and how I attach them to my open to close transactions. Shout out to Christy for requesting this video or uh, these instructions. Uh, you are rocking it. Keep on keeping on. Um, and I will go ahead and hop in. All right, so the first thing you'll wanna do is go into your inbox and the way that I set this up is um, I do have this new transaction that just got back on um, 21275 flowering and that's how I set up my filter. Um, oh, it didn't take my, oh, my number lock's probably on 21275. So you add the numbers and the street name Click down here, you'll create a filter. You will click apply the label and then you'll add a new label. I'm going to call this flowering. Nest under the team. Create. And I'm not going to do matching conversations for now because I it was under contract before. I'm going to manually add the ones that I want to add into this for the new contract. So create filter. Now you'll see here it's been added. Once it's added here, you can go to open to close. Flowering. And that's the terminated one. This is a new one. You'll go into emails, API synced emails, choose label, look for it here, flowering, and all of the emails will now show up in um, the uh, in in this column here, um, and. Yeah, you'll have everything uh, set up here and you can also access it through your mail icon here. That's it. 